we are providing Nödnet to uh, the Norwegian people, to our first responders, and it is very important that they get a good system. It is uh, our opinion that we have to do Tetra if we are going to deliver good group communication, to have uh, data possibilities and make a network that performs over a big area. It was very important uh, to have a supplier uh, that makes a living from these kinds of systems. Then Motorola has a long time experience with the networks deliveries all over the world and we trust them that we can cooperate for a long time. So Norway represents the largest public safety contract that Motorola Solutions has ever undertaken. We've developed the technology for many years to meet the needs of public safety users. But a nationwide project like this is not just about technology. It's actually a complex systems integration exercise. It's everything from supply chain and logistics, through to design and engineering, through to working with local subcontractors in Norway. On a project like this, we always start with the customer. We sit with the user agencies, the people who are going to be the users of the network, and understand what they want to do with the technology. We then take those requirements, we turn that into a design, and then it becomes really about a supply chain and logistics exercise. We are delivering three switch sites that ensures a resilient core network. We are delivering 300 control rooms and 750 operator seats. It's about 500 people in our operation, uh, dealing with everything from engineering, designing core network, designing transmission, till deploying the radio network in the field. We're building more than 2,000 base station sites across Norway to provide radio coverage. We're going to ship about 1,000 base stations this year. That represents actually more than 200 articulated lorry loads of equipment that we ship from Berlin to Norway and then we have to ship that equipment all over Norway facing the challenges of the mountainous terrain and the weather. Once we've deployed the network we're also responsible to manage the operations for a further 12 years. Having one party responsible for everything is important in that. We have a comprehensive set of KPIs defined uh, that covers all the individual network elements, everything from transmission lines, base stations, down to the important routers in the core network. Everything is being monitored and we get reports out that tells us how the uh, network elements are functioning. We also do have uh, a lot of KPIs uh, going the uh, service availability and this is really important and maybe more important. This is how the end users out in the street really experience the network. In Norway we have a big country, 324,000 square kilometers and we are only 5 million people. And all these 5 million people, they expect that the radio coverage is excellent wherever they are or live. Outdoor, indoor, or helicopters in the air, and in hundreds of tunnels, and it's all supposed to work from day one. On our national scale, maybe even an international scale, it's a big investment, and we have to secure that we have value for, for many years to come.